Yo, what is up you guys? It's Corey the Comeback Kid here, back at again with another live commentary for you guys today. Playing some Modern Warfare 3. Hopefully we can, uh, you know, get a little live MOAP on these noobs. They're absolute garbage. Hopefully. I actually haven't played a single game in the past two hours. Uh, so, yeah, hopefully we get something. So today I actually want to talk a little bit about a life story. And this is another Beach Week life story. So, if you guys didn't, well, haven't, like, you know, watched me for quite some time... Well, I want to even say quite some time. I would say like the past a week and a half. You guys would know I went to Beach Week. And if you guys don't know what Beach Week is, it's Senior Week. It's basically when a bunch of seniors get together and go up to the beach and basically get turned out of our minds. So this story actually takes place on the car ride up. So my car ride up was not the most enjoyable, I would say. So the night before I actually went up for Beach Week, I got sick. Did I really just get fucking C4 and free for all? Who the fuck runs C4 and free for all? I'll tell you who. A fucking nerd. Alright, so on my way up to the beach, um, I was basically just having a bunch of stomach problems, if you guys catch my drift here. So I basically got the shits in the car. So, um, you know, the shits aren't the most fun thing. And I would say this was probably the worst car ride I've ever had. Like, in all honesty, one of the worst car rides I've ever had just because of this situation. So for, I would say, the first, like, 30 minutes or so after we left, I was doing perfectly fine. I was like, oh, all right. You know, I woke up in the morning feeling a little bit like morning sickness kind of thing. And I was like, oh, shit, this is just my luck. Right before beach week, of course, I get sick. It's my luck. Only my luck. And, of course, fucking Predator missiles. My fucking luck, too. Might as well shoot myself in the fucking dome. Am I right? Fuck people. You suck cock. So, yeah, it was about, I would say, like, 30 minutes into the drive up. Where the fuck this dude go? All right. It was 30 minutes into the drive up, and we were all just wondering when it was going to hit, basically. Well, I don't say all of us. I would say just me. I was wondering when this shit was going to happen. So we realized we need to fix our tire pressure since apparently someone said our tire pressure was low and obviously it was not that low. Not low enough. Not low enough to drop your booty to the motherfucking floor and twerk it if you know what I'm saying. So we pull up to the gas station and there's a Dunkin Donuts there and we're like alright once we get gas well first we need a little bit more gas. So we got gas and checked our tire pressure and the tire pressure was perfectly fine so the people who told us we need to get it checked and fixed are absolute fucking jackasses and they can go fuck themselves. Not really they're really nice people for looking out for us but you know still fuck them. So we all go over to the um to the Dunkin Donuts and we're like alright so let's let's just get some food. And then we'll just roll out. So everyone gets their food and we're all sitting down just eating like normal. And we're all just talking and that stuff. Nothing too crazy. I just got fucking drop shot in a game that's five years old. Grow a fucking nutsack, kid. Alright, so what occurred is as soon as I took a bite into that donut, it's like I took a bite into tearing up my asshole. It was like Satan just like took a nice vacation to my butt. He was like, yo, you want your asshole to go on a nice little trip? I was like, yeah, you know what? Why not? And I took, literally, I sprinted to the bathroom. I was like, yo, I, I gotta go. I gotta go. So I literally sprinted to the bathroom, and it was absolutely awful. I destroyed that toilet, right? That was kind of nice. 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 Okay, that was kind of nice. <laughs> For me, that was kind of nice. Put me in phase. Oh, shit. Put me in phase, motherfucker. I'm nice as shit. Fuck you. So what happened after that is, after I destroyed the Dunkin' Donuts toilet, I was like, you know what? All right. I'll come back out, finish my meal, just get back in the car. We'll drive up to the beach. I'll relax, right? I went to that bathroom, I would say, three or four more times, and I demolished that bitch. I mean, give me a sledgehammer of shit, and I just... Wop that shit. It was like my anus was asking to get ravaged. Like I got drugged, Bill Cosby, word to you, and fucked by a tranny, word to you, Tyga. Hashtag recent news, motherfucker. So we get right back in the car after I went shit like 10 times. Everyone's like, Jesus Christ, Corey. So I get into the car and we all head out, go back onto the highway, and we're we're like 50 minutes into the trip. Everything's going well. My butt's not hurting as much anymore. I'm like, all right, we're fine. I'm going to take a nap. As soon as I put my head against that window, holy shit. I swear, it's like just a, just a 
roll right through me. Just like a... Just rolled right out of me. I swear I was going to shit myself. Like, I truly thought... I was going to shit my pants in the car, and I was never going to live this down again. This would be the worst moment in my entire life. So I scream at the driver, my friend Zach. I'm like, yo, you need you need to pull over right now. You need to pull over. He's like, dude, I can't. I can't. I'm three lanes over. There's no way we can. And he's right. We were three lanes over, and there was no way he could. But I still made him do it. Headshot, bitch. Ready? Headshot, bitch. So he literally has to cut off three people in order for me to go take a shit and truly i think it benefited him in the long run like i saved his car from being covered in shit so as soon as we get off the highway this is when hell breaks loose straight up hell my anus is ready to be open like a levee to allow water into a river or something whatever that thing's called and literally this shit was going to be water like i could tell this was going to be the meanest diarrhea of 2015 I win that award. Like, at the Grammys and shit, they give me the shit award if you catch my drift because I said Grammys and shit. So I'm like, all right, yo, just go to that Denny's right there since there's a Denny's as soon as we get off the exit. So he gets ready to turn to the Denny's. There's a fucking median in the way. I mean, you it, literally this median went down for like three or four blocks. Meanwhile, my anus is a fucking ticking time bomb, yo. Straight up, like I stamped, this thing was a ticking time bomb. So I'm thinking my worst fear is about to happen. I'm gonna shit my pants right in front of three of my best friends, and they are never gonna let me live this moment down for the rest of my life. And how I knew that? My best friend who's sitting next to me since I, like, my best friend since kindergarten, straight up tells me he's pulling out his phone for Snapchat just in case I shit myself. That's what friends are for. But then we finally found a McDonald's for me and I just unleashed on that McDonald's toilet for about 15 minutes, came back into the car and I straight up just went to sleep for two more hours until we got to the beach. And I took, I would say like a four hour nap when I got there. And let's just say I started to get so hyped when I woke up that all that feeling went away. I drank too much and I shit 10 times more due to beer shits that next morning so that was pretty fun but once again i do hope you guys did enjoy today's life story it was kind of more of a disgusting one but at the same time i found it to be a pretty funny life story thought you guys would enjoy hearing it just to make fun of me for the next two hours of your life so anyways once again it's been the comeback kid here or Corey. hope you guys did enjoy today's video once more if you did make sure you hit that like button it always means a lot let's try getting 20 likes you know we've hit 20 likes once maybe we can do it again anyways it's been your boy Corey here or comeback I'll catch you guys later. Peace. Words to Bill Cosby. I'll rape you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh.